Any road win is a good win. This could be a key juncture of their season right here in these final seconds of overtime in Philadelphia. Lamb on a career high night trying to add to those 31 points. Well, he has been ice water. Ooh, boys. Oh, second one pops out. Now they don't need a three. No. Ten seconds to go. The freshman Johnson all the way to the bucket. Five and a half to go for UConn. Napier, they have a timeout. They don't use it for the win. Perhaps two tenths of a second still on the clock. Oh. Woo Onions. There was no question that he was going to take that. Well, they have to put. They have to look at the clock. Make sure that. There's not more time that went off, but what a what a shot. Oh. From way beyond the NBA line, Shabazz Napier called out his teammate Saturday and then backed up his words <laughs> with a tremendous shot from well beyond the arc, and they're gonna go look at the clock. But either way, it's gonna be a three-point lead for UConn. Well, pretty much say what you want after that. Trey by Chavez. Who would have thought with that much time he'd get it further down the floor, but why? Yeah, he should get maybe a few more seconds or tens, don't you think? Yeah, it looked like maybe 0.5. Yeah. Which there is a is. big difference because theoretically you'd have a chance right to there, catch and point shoot. 0.8 at least, right? That's, I'd say point, point 0.6 or 7. Because it's when it clears <laughs> the net. How about that kid? Well, he's got Moxie. Steps up. I'm sure his teammates a little upset but as you said early in the game Sean if you can back it up I guess you can say what you want and it came in three for his last 20 mm. from three point range <laughs> and then does that two for four beyond the arc tonight splash the ball still in the net there maybe point seven point six. As long as it's more than point two, you got 